it's huge. Um, anytime there's conflict, apology, forgiveness, open heart, open mind, you know, a softness for each other is absolutely required or too many grudges get held and too much stuff comes up from the past. I think if you're not willing to admit that you have faults, then, then it's just not going to work. <laughs> if you can't apologize and mean it and really just let it go, then it'll come up again and again and again. So when you forgive, you have to forget about it, let it go. I think you have to know that when you're arguing that it's over and done with and that you're forgiven and your partner needs to know that you've forgiven them and everything's okay. She keeps looking back, hint, hint. <laughs> Extre extremely important. I think it's, it's, you can't move on if you don't, if you have an argument, you can't move on unless you apologize and forgive. And that's what God, that's what God taught us to do is to forgive and to move on. So that's what's important. Uh, major, <laughs> major. I mean, if you can't forgive the other person, I mean, God forgives those. I mean, God forgives everyone. And if we can't forgive, you know, it's not worth it. It's probably the the biggest lie ever told is is from love story when they say love means never having to say you're sorry. Love means always having to say you're sorry, and being willing to do that is. Uh, I've seen couples sometimes go weeks sometimes um, where there, nobody will just kind of step mm -hmm. forward and, and ask for that forgiveness and yet the minute you do it all of a sudden there's just like this tremendous weight that comes off your shoulders and, mm -hmm. and uh, you have to do it daily and sometimes yeah. even more than once and in sometimes a day. even more than once in a day that's true <laughs>